The flam stroke. The flam stroke can be virtually incorporated into every drum beat or fill that you play. What is the flam stroke? It is nothing but bringing down both your hands together at the same time and striking the drum. But one hand strikes just before the other, like this. The flam accent is a powerful drum rudiment that incorporates the basic flam with a triplet feel. Right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. The flam tap integrates the flam into a basic double stroke pattern. It goes right, right, left, left. The flam EQ is to be played with both right and left hand leading alternatively. It goes right, left, right, left, right where it begins with a flam and ends with a flam and the same applies for left. The flam paradiddle adds flam shots to the single paradiddle. It goes like Right, left, right, right, left, right, left, left. The single flam mill is an interesting rudiment that incorporates flams with a paradiddle like foundation. It goes right, right, left, right, left, left, right, left. The flam paradiddle diddle is a combination of the single paradiddle diddle and the flam stroke. It goes right left right right left left right left right right left left. The pat -a -fla is a unique drum rudiment that requires you to play flam strokes back to back with the same hand. It goes Right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. The Swiss Army Triplet is a unique one-way rudiment that can be played with both right and left hand leads. Right, right, left, right, right, left. The inverted flam tap looks fairly simple but it's quite a difficult rudiment to master. It goes right, left, left, right with flams on the first and the third strokes alternating. The flam drag is a drum rudiment that alternates between flams and drags within the structure of an alternating double stroke roll. The single drag is a foundational rudiment that is used to play many advanced patterns. It is best for ghost notes or to begin with for simple fills.
the single drag tab expands on the drag rough with one added tap stroke. It goes left, left, right, left, right, right, left, right. double drag tab expands on the pattern set out by the single drag tab. You play two drags before the tab. It goes left, left, right, left, left, right, left, right, right, left, right, right, left, right. Lesson 25 is an interesting rudiment because the name does not have a special meaning. It seems more appropriate to be called drag tap tap. It goes left left right left right left left right left right. The single dragadiddle drum rudiment incorporates a drag stroke into the single paradiddle. It goes right, right, left, right, right, left, left, right, left, left. The drag paradiddle one incorporates a drag before the single paradiddle. So it goes right, left, left, right, left, right, right, left, right, right, left, right, left, left. This incorporates two drags before the single paradiddle and it goes right, left, left, right, left, left, right, left, right, right, left, right, right, left, right, right, left, right, left, left. The single Ratama Q is first in the series of Ratama Q rudiments. It is made up of single strokes and drags. It goes left, left, right, left, right, left, right, right, left, right, left, right. The double Ratcham IQ is still based on the single Ratcham IQ. A few drags and some single strokes. It goes left, left, right, left, left, right, left, right, left, right, right, left, right, right, left, right, left, right. The triple Ratchama Q is last in the series of the Ratchama Q rudiments. Same combination of drags and single strokes.
Make sure you're playing all these rudiments with proper stick grip. Playing without proper stick grip could hurt your hand. Also, it is important to choose the best drumstick for you. Now, let me show you a few patterns, easy exercises for you to play. Let's play the hi hat. Now, add the bass drum in one. Add the snare drum in three. Now, double this pattern and play Now add a bass in 4 so it becomes Now add a snare in 8 These are simple beats that you could play Now wherever you want to add a fill just play Or you could also play The double stroke roll There are two ways to play the double stroke roll One is the bounce back technique Where you strike the drum and allow the stick to bounce back The other one is you use your wrist and physically strike the drum twice Right, right, left, left both are good techniques and must be practiced equally. The trick to mastering the double stroke roll is to make both the hands and both the strokes sound the same. Close your eyes and listen. Are they sounding the same? The triple paradiddle. The triple paradiddle also is an extension of the single paradiddle. It goes like this right, left, right, left, right, left, right, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, left. The single paradiddle is one of the most hardest rudiments to master. But once you master this rudiment, you will be amazed at the doors it opens to new solos, beats and grooves. It is played right, left, right, right, left, right, left, left. Double paradiddle. As a drummer, the double paradiddle must be among the top five rudiments that you practice regularly. The double paradiddle is very similar to the single paradiddle. It goes like this right, left, right, left, right, right, left, right, left, right, left, left. The flam accent is a powerful drum rudiment that incorporates the basic flam with a triplet feel. Right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. Right, left. The flam tap 
integrates the flam into a basic double stroke pattern. It goes right, right, left, left. The single drag is a foundational rudiment that is used to play many advanced patterns. It is best for ghost notes or to begin with for simple fills. The single drag tap expands on the drag rough with one added tap stroke. It goes left, left, right, left, right, right, left, right. I hope learning these 40 essential rudiments of drumming is going to be really helpful for all of you. All you have to do is practice more and make it perfect. I'd like to thank Super Audio Company 
for having called me here to present this and explain these 40 rudiments of drumming before you. I'd also like to thank Mrs. Aruna Sivaramakrishnan and Mr. Sivaramakrishnan for inviting me to do this project. I'm very thankful to my gurus, my family and my friends.